Hi, my name is Megan. I work at University Branch Library, and today I'm going to show you how to make three really simple crafts out of regular old paint chip samples. I'll show you how to make earrings, a greeting card, and a gift tag. Now you may be wondering, why would I use paint chip samples instead of colored cardstock or construction paper? Quite simply, paint chip samples are free. They come in a huge variety of shades, and all of these crafts require very small amounts of paper. So instead of buying a bunch of paper, you can just use the free paint chip samples at the store. Just don't go crazy and take all of the paint chip samples because that wouldn't be very nice. For this craft, you will need paint chips, a piece of cardboard, a thumbtack, paper punches or scissors, glue, pliers, earring hooks, and four jump rings. You can use any combination of colors and shapes you like. I'm using circles because I happen to have hole punches in three different sizes. If you're hand cutting your shapes, you can cut them in any shape you like. For your largest circle, you will need to cut four holes. This is so that the text on the back of the largest circle doesn't show. The smaller circles will be glued onto the larger ones, so you only need two of those. Once all of your circles are ready, glue the larger ones together. Now simply glue the smaller circles on top. Allow the glue to dry for a few minutes so that your circles don't slide around as you finish your earrings. Now place your circles on top of the cardboard and use the thumbtack to pierce small holes into the tops of the earrings where the hooks will go. Notice that I wiggle the thumbtack a bit to make sure that these small holes are big enough for the jump rings to pass through easily. Open a jump ring and attach it to your first earring. Use the pliers to close the jump ring. Repeat this for the second earring. Now attach another jump ring to the first earring hook and the jump ring that you've already put on the earring. Close it up and you've got your first completed earring. Repeat all of this for the second earring and you're done. For this craft, you will need cardstock, paint chips, a paper punch or scissors, glue, and a pen or marker. Take the cardstock and fold it in half twice to create a blank card. Next, just punch out your shapes. I have three of the same paint chip and I'm going to punch a heart out of each section to make a total of 12 hearts. You can always hand cut your shapes if you don't have a paper punch in the shape that you want. Now I just glue them onto the card in whatever design that I like. All set and I'm ready to give this card to someone I love. Paint chip gift tags are super easy to make. You will need a paint chip, a pen or marker, 
a single hole punch and a large circle hole punch or scissors. I like to use the paint chips that have multiple colors on them and I cut my circles so that the dividing line between the shades is about halfway down from the top of my gift tag. Give one half of the circle a little bit more room for the small hole punch that will be used to attach the tag to a gift. Now, simply add the to and from fields and you're ready to give your gift away. So there you have it, three super quick and easy crafts that you can do with paint chips and items that you have around the house. My examples are pretty basic, but the sky is the limit when it comes to your creativity. I hope you've enjoyed this video and please subscribe to our YouTube channel so you never miss out on a virtual program.